സ്വാമി എ ഇ ശരണമയ്യപ്പ ആർ യു നോട്ട് ഏബിൾ ടു അണ്ടർടേക്ക് എ പിൽഗ്രിമേജ് ടു ശബരിമല ഈവൻ ഇഫ് യു വിഷ് ഹിയർ ഇസ് എ റേർ ഓപ്പർച്യൂണിറ്റി ഓഫേർഡ് ബൈ ആസ്ട്രവെഡ് ടു ഹെൽപ്പ് യു ടു ഫുൾഫിൽ യുവർ പ്രേയേഴ്സ് ടു ലോഡ് അയ്യപ്പ ത്രൂ എ പ്രോക്സി ആസ്ട്രവെഡ് ഹാസ് മെയ്ഡ് അറേഞ്ച്മെൻറ്റ്സ് ടു ഫുൾഫിൽ യുവർ പ്രേയേഴ്സ് ടു ലോഡ് അയ്യപ്പ ബൈ ഓഫറിംഗ് കോക്കനട്ട് ഫിൽഡ് വിത്ത് ഗീ and perform gi abhishekam to lord ayappa on your behalf early millions of people visit the abode of lord ayappa to fulfill their prayers the beginning of kartikeya month is a sacred time for the ayappa devotees the first thing comes to their mind on the first day of kartikeya is to go to the temple take a vow to follow a very strict ritual to undertake the pilgrimage to this famous abode of lord ayappa the sabarimala on the first of kartikeya month a devotee who wish to undertake a pilgrimage to sabarimala gets up early in the morning and after bathing will wear a black dhoti and will wrap a black towel around the neck he will offer prayers to the kula devata and visit a temple the devotee would carry a mala made of tulasi beads which he had already purchased after offering prayers to the deity in the temple the devotee will offer his mala to the temple priest or a guru swami and seek their blessings a guru swami is one who has completed 18 years of continuous pilgrimage to the abode of ayappa the guru swami or the priest after praying to lord ayappa will put the mala around the neck of the devotee from that time the grand pilgrimage begins for the ayappa devotees most of us have worn the holy mala for lord ayappa and have observed this fasting for 48 days and carry ghee filled with coconut kept in the bag which is carried on the head known as irumudi on having the divine darshan of gi abhishekam to lord ayappa all the devotees would feel that all their sins are wiped off and it is a new birth for them they also would feel that all their sorrows are totally wiped off no way we can see that a devotee become so excited year after year to undertake this pilgrimage Many devotees of Ayappa have undertaken this pilgrimage continuously for more than 30 or 40 years. It's a blessing from Lord Ayappa himself to continuously perform this pilgrimage. In the modern times due to various commitments it may not be possible for some people even though they try hard to undertake this pilgrimage to Sabarimala. they may not be able to visit the sacred shrine of lord ayappa in sabarimala and this gives immense pain for a devotee nowadays many elderly people were also not able to visit the lord ayappa shrine on top of the hills of sabarimala in order to help these devotees who wish to offer prayers to lord ayappa and to send the coconut filled with ghee to sabarimala shrine astrovid has started a proxy service by availing the service one can offer ghee for abhishekam yes it's really a rare opportunity that astrovid has made arrangements to carry the coconut filled with ghee by placing it in the bags of those devotees who regularly visit sabarimala every year these devotees will carry the coconut filled with ghee on their heads on your behalf and make sure your prayers are fulfilled astrovid make sure these pious devotees of lord ayappa go on the trip peacefully and with complete devotion by taking care of their essential needs like travel clothing food etc the most significant event of this holy trip the mandala puja is on december 25th 2023 and the ceremony of wearing the irumudi kattu is on 
January 7, 2024. Astrobed has made arrangements to telecast the Mandala Puja and Nirmudu Ketu events live to all the devotees who opt for the service. We welcome you all to seek the blessings of Swami Ayapa and to make the most of this unique opportunity. For details, you can log on to Astrobed website and register yourself for the service. Swami Saranamaya Pope